Hi, it's Caitlin, and I'm here with new polishes from Cleona Cosmetics. There are a lot. As always, I will plug my affiliate code, which will save you 6% on the Cleona Cosmetics website off pretty much anything you buy, including these polishes. It's Caitlin Swatches, all caps, all one word. I'll include it down in the description. And these will be launching on December 30th, which if I get it out ahead of time, or if not, they're available now. That will be down in the description as well. And I'm just really excited to show these off. Everything is super beautiful. So I think we should just get into it. So before we get into the polishes themselves, I wanted to show off the boxes for the new Slickadelic polishes. They're really fun and hollow. And I just love Cleona Cosmetics packaging. We're going to take a look first at the Space Time Slicks, and these ones are absolutely incredible. They're packed with hollow, and I'm going to show these polishes magnetized using the Cleona Cosmetics magnet, which you can pick up in their shop. I've got it underneath my index finger, and this polish is called Gravity Well. It has a beautiful, rich black base, and then it's got an incredible multi-chrome magnetized shimmer. It's that beautiful sort of teal to purple multi-chrome, and you will see it a little bit better when I do my full hand shot. You can see all of the color shifts, but this one, along with all the other space time slicks, are a beautiful coupling of holographic and shifting pigments with tiny little flakes and this one has a fantastic formula on my middle finger here I'm showing it with a it's like a KB shimmer bar magnet I have it's the same one I think that hollow taco uses and you can of course use any kind of magnet but I do think the neodymium bar magnets work best so here you can see two coats plus top coat on each of the nails and these polishes look like an instant galaxy on your nail which i love so much they're totally opaque in two coats and you can see that beautiful purple blue shift you get at more extreme angles and it even goes to like a hot pink orange at really extreme angles and then of, of course it's a beautiful turquoise under direct lighting this one is so beautiful and i just love how it looks moving along we have quasar and this one is definitely for the green lovers but it has some really interesting shifts to it as well this has that beautiful black base and what's really interesting to me about the space time slicks which are the first seven polishes that i'm going to show you these all have a really beautiful black base but they appear to be made up of entirely flakes which is so interesting i think it just makes it super super shifty and very very twinkly and galaxy like is almost as if the nail polish is made up of billions of little stars so that's it with two coats on my index finger i couldn't figure out with this first set of magnetic polishes how to show both of my fingers being magnetized at the same time using the cleona cosmetics bar magnet I had to do it separately because the magnet itself, in my opinion, works better when you hold it over the nail versus using it under the nail, which is what I was doing. Anyway, I figured out a solution, but I am extremely lazy when it comes to magnetic polishes, so having the magnet under your nail is definitely the easiest way to go, which is what I did with this different bar magnet you're seeing underneath my middle finger.
these polishes do dry down a little bit dull, so you definitely want a good glossy top coat. I am using the Cuticula Limitless Quick Dry Top Coat for all of my swatches, and that really enhances the holographic effect and creates a very glossy finish in no time at all. It dries very quickly. And Quasar has this beautiful, bright green magnetic effect to it. And just, I love the way it comes together here. You can see how it's got like a golden green shift to it. And then at more extreme angles, you get a blue shift. This is extremely sparkly and twinkly. I didn't have any natural sunlight when I was swatching these, but you can see under artificial lighting just how pretty that holographic effect is. And these also look amazing out of direct lighting, as you can see here. Next up is Event Horizon, and this one is a beautiful, beautiful magnetic with a really pretty purple to pinky blue multi-chrome magnetic shift, as you will see. And I didn't think to show any of these not magnetized, but they do look beautiful without the magnetic effect as well. But of course, in my opinion, they're magnetic polishes, so they're meant to be magnetized, and that's what I am showing off. But you will notice that with the black magnet bar underneath my index fingers, that doesn't have as strong of a magnetic effect so it gives you a sense of how it will look unmagnetized. And then with this silver magnet underneath my middle fingers, you definitely get a stronger, tighter magnetic line. So it's all about your preference. And of course, if you wanted, you could do that sort of velvet magnetic effect, which I show off in the Cirque Colors Atelier collection swatch video, if anyone's curious. So Event Horizon, just like all the previous polishes, is completely opaque in two coats. These polishes dry very quickly. They are not difficult to remove, and as you can see, they applied very easily and didn't run off the nail. They have an amazing formula, which is what I've come to expect from Cleona Cosmetics. So you can see here, this is a beautiful purple that shifts into this really golden and pink at extreme angles. The holographic in this polish and all of them is really so interesting and rainbowy. This also has like a green shift at super extreme angles, which I think is absolutely gorgeous. Here we have Spaghettification, which might win for best name in the collection. And this one has an incredible golden green magnetic effect to it. And once again, these build up best in two coats. And it's just amazing to me how these are essentially all coming with a clear base, but they're just packed with these tiny, tiny little magnetic shifty flakes that create this gorgeous overall effect. This one in particular is very luxurious and opulent in my opinion. It's actually kind of perfect for New Year's Eve. And for all of these, obviously, I'm using the magnet underneath my finger, which, in my opinion, is probably the easiest way to apply a magnet polish because it's there. You don't have to really do any manual labor holding the magnet over your nail because the key with magnetic polishes is holding the magnet either under or over your nail 
for the duration of time it takes for the polish to dry as well as after you apply top coat because once you apply top coat it sort of re-wets the polish and the particles spread so if you want that magnetic effect to stay you need to apply the magnet under or over the nail as the top coat dries so here you can see spaghettification it's got that incredible gold to it which shifts to a beautiful lime green chartreuse at extreme angles and it also almost looks like a forest green at some other angles so this one is just beautiful in my opinion and this one is called singularity and singularity is a beautiful sort of pinky magenta effect when you apply the magnet in that black base with all of the hollow in it and i'm not actually sure but i'm pretty sure the flakes also include like holographic flakes it's not a micro glitter i think everything in this polish in the space time slick collection is flake based and that means it's not going to be difficult to remove none of these stained my nails whatsoever and they're all just a dream to work with honestly i have nothing but good things to say about these polishes if you like magnetic nail polish these are going to make your day and recently i attended a conference where the guest speaker was talking about artificial intelligence and this concept of singularity which i guess is the ai that knows everything and is what everybody fears but he reassured everybody that we're far off from that so this nail polish name makes me think of ai which i find to be scary and also just i don't know it's it's interesting obviously we've been using it for years and a lot of what we benefit from is considered artificial intelligence but i just i don't want it every day in my life <laughs> So this polish, however, I do want in my life every day. This has a beautiful magenta shift that goes to a golden green at extreme angles. This one is really beautiful. I mean, these polishes are so entertaining because they look different every time you move your hand. It's like three polishes in one. This one's called Wormhole and this one is the blue in the collection this one is super beautiful just even watching this video back as i apply the polish it's really fun to see just how beautifully these go on the magnetic effect is absolutely gorgeous and i can't wait to wear them again so this one as you can see has like a beautiful bright cobalt blue and the hollow in this one works so well this one really looks very galaxy like to me and i really do love the addition of the hollow in these magnetic polishes i love the hollow that cleona cosmetics uses i think it's extremely rainbowy which is something i appreciate because there are cheaper versions of hollow that some nail polish makers use it's not as rainbowy or sparkly but the cleona cosmetics formula and the hollow that they use is very high quality very holographic and extremely rainbowy which to me is the whole point of hollow So you might notice that these do dry down a little bit dull, but they're not textured by any means. One layer of a quick dry glossy top coat will smooth out everything completely, and then you can enjoy this beautiful finish. So Wormhole shifts to a really beautiful purple, 
And again, with that holographic effect, everything just works so well together. It looks like a galaxy on your nails. I guess it's supposed to look like a wormhole. And it's just so dreamy. I'm very entranced by all of these polishes. I think that magnetics are just so pretty. Last from the um, space-time slicks, we have thermonuclear. And thermonuclear has an incredibly beautiful red and orange magnetic stripe to it when you apply the magnet. And I'm not sure if it was my imagination, but I feel like thermonuclear also had the most um, apparent magnetic effect to it. So the particles in this one just seem to really easily show up with both of the magnets that I used. I also happen to love this one the most. I think it might be my favorite from the space-time slicks, and I love the juxtaposition of rainbowy hollow, the black base, and of course that red-pink magnetic stripe. It just looks so good. flakes in this one just look super fiery in my opinion and it's super beautiful so again this is really good in two coats I don't really know if people will need three and if you want you could also layer these over a black cream and then just do one coat or two coats of the magnetic polish depending on how you like to wear your nail polish. So here's Thermonuclear. It looks so fiery. It works so well with the name. And you can see green, gold, and a yellowy red, or maybe it's actually an orange at extreme angles. It's got a pinky red effect under direct light. And this one is so flamey and fiery it just works so beautifully now we're moving into the chroma slicks which are pastelized chrome polishes that have a really easy to work with metallic finish and they magnetize to reveal a rich colored base these ones have shifting multicolored pigments in various sizes for an extra groovy finish and before I talk about portal in specific terms, these polishes are going to be perfect for anyone who loved the sold out Fire and Ice duo, which came out in November. So portal is a beautiful pastel mint green. This one is so fresh and wintry. And here I'm just using two different bar wand magnets. I put them down on my mat and then put my fingers on top. I love the effect of these chrome slicks. This one you can see when you apply the magnet and with all of them, the magnetic line appears as sort of this silvery white stripe and then you get the pastel base revealed underneath and it also reveals these beautiful multicolored flakes which are so pretty and catch the light beautifully so this one i went with three coats and top coat and you can see how the minty green base shifts to a darker green with hints of gold and then you almost get turquoise and blue at extreme angles these ones are super futuristic in my opinion the chroma slicks are very unique, very avant-garde, and I really, really love them. We also had a tiny bit of sun when I swatched this, so you can see just how pretty it is in the sunlight. Next up, we have Mirrored Self, and 
this one is just this beautiful unique brownie red you do not see enough browns but this one is so gorgeous and i'm so happy to and see it to see it included in this collection this one looks incredible with or without the magnet applied and i will note that the chroma slicks are definitely sheerer than the space time slicks so you're most likely going to need three coats depending on your polishing style i obviously have extremely short nails with barely any free edge so two coats sometimes worked for me but sometimes i also threw on a third coat it just depends how you like your polish so you can see just how beautiful this one is it kind of reminds me of like psychedelic gingerbread the base is obviously brown but it's also got red to it it reminds me of like beautiful rich spices like cinnamon and i love the way it reveals these tiny little multicolored pastel iridescent flakes they catch the light beautifully and i just love this one I will recommend Glossy Top Coat for all of these because they dry down a little bit dull and of course Top Coat makes everything better but it also, with these polishes in particular, really enhances the ability to see those little multicolored flakes. So here's this one in the full hand shot. The magnetic effect is just so cool. It's like yeah this one is just like really trippy i really like it and it's so unique moving along we have doppelganger and doppelganger is a gorgeous yellow shade honestly all of these polishes just blew my mind with how beautiful and unique they are cleona cosmetics is they're just masterminds when it comes to creating unique and beautiful and also really well-made products. So Doppelganger is sort of like, it reminds me of like a Peeps Easter marshmallow that's just like on an acid trip. So this has an incredibly beautiful indigo violet shimmer to it, which you can probably get a little taste of, but you're gonna see it more obviously in the full hand shot. And this one I was happy with in two coats because it kind of blends in with my skin tone so it worked leaving it a little more sheer but if you have a different skin tone than me you might want to deepen it up in three coats but these formulas are so easy to work with they dry quickly and they're not difficult to remove at all so here hopefully you can see that sort of violet shimmer it looks so cool with the yellow chartreuse base and the little iridescent flakes in there are just so pretty. This one is so unique and gorgeous. I just absolutely love it. And now we're moving along to Parallel Universe. So Parallel Universe is this beautiful baby blue that leans a tiny bit turquoise and it has a gorgeous really shifty shimmer in there it's like hints of pink green it's incredible this one again has a fantastic formula as you can see these polishes go on very very easily they don't run off the fingernail they're not pooling on the edges of my nails or at my cuticles it's just the perfect consistency it's so easy to work with and again if you're applying these with the magnet under your finger they're pretty much foolproof so if magnets or magnetized polishes intimidate you that's definitely the way i recommend using magnetic nail polish and if you have a whole bunch of magnets it's even easier because you can just place your finger on top of 
you know, four different magnets and then go from there so you don't have to wait and move the magnet for every finger you paint. So this one built up beautifully. Again, the top coat really brings this to life. And for anyone who missed their fire and ice duo, this one, the name is escaping me right now. I think it was called Of Ice. This one is probably really close to it and it will definitely satisfy the craving for it if you missed out on it. And you can see this has a beautiful shift to it at extreme angles. I love the green. It's just so dreamy. Again, this is like another groovy psychedelic polish. Everything works together so beautifully. Here we have alternate reality, which instantly when I saw it in the bottle, I knew I was going to love this one. It didn't disappoint on the nail. So this one is a icy baby pink. It has a beautiful sort of blue shimmer to it. And of course, those tiny little multicolored flakes. And then when you apply the magnet, that silvery, cool shimmer just really comes out. This is like sort of a ballerina moment. Like, it's so beautiful to me. It's so delicate, but also like a cyborg, like a ballerina cyborg. That's what I'm going to call this one. I was happy with this in two coats again, probably because my nails are so short and I have very pale skin. This one worked well in two coats. It's just stunning. Honestly, I'm so curious what everyone thinks of these polishes because I'm obsessed and these chroma slicks are so unique. As you can see, this is absolutely beautiful with that magnetic effect shifting around. You can see the violety blue shimmer at extreme angles and these are perfect for winter. They're so icy and cold, but then the pastel colors are kind of hinting at the spring that's going to come. It's perfect. Now here we have Multiverse. This one is a beautiful pastel purple, super icy with a really pretty pink shimmer to it, like a golden pink shimmer. And again, fantastic formula. I love the way those iridescent flakes pop out. And this is just so unique and beautiful. I also love the name of this one. It reminds me of the film Everything Everywhere All at Once. If you haven't seen it, definitely check it out. Definitely incorporates the concept of a multiverse. And I, I just love all of those ideas. It makes me feel hopeful that there's some alternate universe out there where everybody is completely happy and we're all at peace as a society and as a world and as humanity with animals and in harmony with everything. Anyway, this one has a fantastic formula. Again, no surprise there. This is a really pretty shade of purple. It's really unique and different from a lot of the purples I have. Like it's not a traditional pastel purple. It's really deep and you're going to love this one when I show the whole hand here. You can see that golden shimmer. It also almost touches on green at really extreme angles. It's just so cool. Again, I love the cyborgy android robot silvery kiss to all of these polishes. And last but not least, we have Different Dimension, which is maybe the ultimate cyborg polish. This one has the deepest base color in the Chroma Slick collection. It's just a really pretty blurple. And the flakes in here are also multicolored, but 
I feel like the pink flakes are standing out the most to me and to my eye. And in this one, the shimmer comes off as especially silver. It's just so cool. I keep saying that, but these polishes are really amazing. I love them. And I personally think they're probably some of my favorite magnetics that I've ever used. I just love how the space-time slicks, they're just so evocative of a galaxy. And then the chroma slicks are very android, cyborg, robot, metal. It's just so cool. I love all the names, the formulas, and everything about them. So here it is in two coats. Hopefully you can see what I mean about the pink flakes the blurple base, and that silver magnetic line. Such a cool effect. And when you go at extreme angles, this one looks really bluey. And I think that works super well with the silver magnetic stripe. From the first batch of the new Slickadelic collection I showed off with the hollow and sort of blackened bases, I'm going to have to go with Thermonuclear. I just love the vibrant like orange and red hues that you get when you apply the magnet to that polish. And yeah, I love that one so much. And a close second would be Wormhole. Just love the blue. I think it looks like outer space and I always love galaxy nails so that one is just a classic in my opinion. And then from the other set of magnetics, the more like pastel silver ones, I super loved alternate reality. I love a soft ballerina pink like that and when you apply the magnet it just looks so pretty but it also looks really pretty even without the magnet applied. And I will also give a shout out to Doppelganger because I love yellow polishes and I loved the shimmer in that one. Um, it was just such a beautiful and unexpected combination and I now can't wait for spring because that polish reminds me of like ducklings and springtime and I don't know why it's not spring yet. So let me know in the comments what you think of these collections of polishes. Let me know if you're planning on picking anything up and if you are, please use my affiliate code and thank you to all of you who do use it. It's not one time use, you can use it again and again. So go wild. That's it for me. I hope you are enjoying the holiday season if you're celebrating and probably I will see you in the new year. Bye.